Emil Machado is 28. Pyle is 30. Six feet for Machado, and their weight pretty much the same. Maybe somebody's chin will decide this one. Uh, there's Mike Pyle. Randy Couture there in the corner. Now let's get it, all the introductions from Mark Biro. Ladies and gentlemen, this Arnold Classic event scheduled three five-minute rounds in the middleweight division. Your judges at ringside are Randy Bloom, Don Fry, and Greg Kalikas. Your referee once again is Richard Fight. Introducing first in the red corner, weighing 175 and one half pounds, pro record, 20 victories, two defeats, one draw. He represents Team Hammer House from Las Vegas, Nevada. Here is Iron Mike. Pile, pile. His opponent in the blue corner, weighing 176 and a half pounds. Pro record, 10 victories, three defeats, one draw, representing Team Gracie and Lijo de la República de Brazil. Here is Emo. Machado, Machado. So Imu Machado and Mike Pyle. Yep, and here we go. Randy Couture in the corner, always good to have in your corner. And nice oh. to have a champion give you some advice as Pyle yep. gets in a right hand. Pyle driver. Machado throw in a big right low kick there. And that one, that, that had a lot of power on it. Whoa, but Mike says, I can do that too. They both had the same idea with the kicks. Look at this. Try to take away the legs of your opponents. Whoop, is it gonna be a takedown now? Let's go for a guillotine, which is very difficult because we have the gloves on. You need to really just slide onto that jaw. Continue locking up, looking for an advantage. Right leg by Machado. They're looking to see who's going to be the one to break out. Yep. Good takedown attempt there by Pyle, and Machado able to deny it. Yeah, he's got the tight clinch. Almost look, oh, very nice. A push with that right hand. And now a jab here by Pyle as he goes into a boxing mode. Looks very relaxed. Both Good left oh. hook by Pyle. Nice. And now here he comes with some attacking. Trying to win it. Look at the offense here. Oh, it's going. Yeah, it's over. It's over. That's how you take advantage of an opportunity. Mike Pyle from the stand-up position shows you how to take advantage of a strike. We've seen the submissions on the ground. We've seen all types of moves. Ankle locks, arm bars. Well, this time we saw the punching power. It was a stiff jab that set it all up. He walked right on that left. Boom, and that was the first, he started getting wobbly, and then like you said, my pal, he smelled the victory, and he started to go in for the kill. This is the guy that's done a lot of rear naked chokes, and he's also been winning by triangles in recent fights. So, that's been the book on him, but he crosses up Machado with the offense. From the striking position, he gets basically a knockout, and... Wow. He really unloads good versatility here by pile okay let's take a look at the replay look here it's going to be the short left boop that was it up oh, that set him off and right away he start to unload not one at a time he goes right for it and gambles to get everything right here and that's the way you do it yep watch how short this left is point see right on the button underneath his underneath his ear on the jaw that will do the trick it's not about the power now, it's the fact that you throw a flurry and the referee is seeing your opponent under siege and will step in for safety reasons so you make the referee come into it 
with Pyle doing his work. The elbows, the gloves, then he gets down and goes to work. This guy is a seasoned finisher. Wow. The Pyle Beautiful. drivers by Pyle. Starts it out with the left hook. Scores a knockdown there, and like a smart fighter, will not let his opponent get back into the mix. So, the Brazilians need it tonight. The power in the boxing does it for Pyle. That was impressive. Let's get the results from Mark Biro. Ladies and gentlemen, the time, one minute, 20 seconds of the first round. The winner by technical knockout, Iron My Pile. Pile. Iron Mike did a, a mixed martial arts version of Iron Mike. Here is the winner again. Reminiscent of Mike Tyson's first Wilson. round. Pyle. Exploits. Really impressive how Mike Pyle took advantage of his opportunity. The left hook, and you just see it all in the mixed martial arts. When a guy senses his opponent is hurt, the good ones can finish it. And he's now standing with Boss Root. Mike, you did it, man. I mean, you saw the opportunity and you took it. Yes, I did. I saw that. Uh was carrying his right hand just a little low. Every time I threw something straight, he was ready to, he was ready to parry everything that I threw straight. Everything I threw straight, he parried it well. Props to him, but uh, I just noticed he was parrying too far with the right. Knew maybe I could catch him with a two, three, with a, with a one, and then a three, then hit him with a two, but the two hit him. And when it hit him, he kind of looked up to count the lights. So, yep. came in to finish him off. Yeah, you start to hammer fist your way all the way up to him and uh, he really yeah he dropped it was a good uh, referee uh, stoppage uh, oh let's take a look at it here we go bring us through it you see how he was parrying really well he was really parrying my hands away everything that I threw straight he parried it very well look at the hammer strikes here yes and as you can see he's out here see how he's blocking everything nice and straight that I throw parries it well So I just put a little hook on it to try to get it on his chin. And uh, I, I suspected that his chin was a little suspect from the Benji Reddick fight. Because Benji Reddick just kind of touched him a little bit and he kind of started to count the lights. So I knew Beautiful. if I get him good, I can finish him. Listen, we have uh, Randy Couture here, ladies and gentlemen, in the corner, your trainer. <laughs> Randy, what about it, man? What did you think? Uh, you know, I've been working out with Mikey for a little over a year now. And I feel like he has... <laughs> Boss, hey. I really feel like Mikey has something special. He's one of my best workout partners for over a year now, and he's getting a chance to show that. What did you think of the result? Did you see it embracing like this? You, you knew this was going to happen? Well, I've seen Zimu fight before. He's a very, very tough fighter. He loves to shoot under those long punches, and we felt like we had a chance if we could keep our distance to find a good shot and land it, and Mikey did his job tonight. All right, guys, thank you so much for coming out tonight. Legit oh, he wants to say? I would also, I would like to uh, thank my sponsors, like Who's Your Daddy at Who's Your Daddy Inc.com, Physogen, and Howard Combat Caminos, and all my training partners back home in Las Vegas at, X, at uh, Zion's Training Center, and Randy Couture, and my girl Tara. I love you, baby. Beautiful. Randy, you got something to say? Oh, congratulations to Mike. Getting ready for another sport fight coming up soon. Look forward to seeing you in, in L.A., boss. <laughs> All right. I will be there, my friend. Congratulations, Congratulations ladies and gentlemen, Mike, Mike Pyle. So Mike Pyle gets it done quickly. A first round TKO submission. Look at that. Can't do it any better than Mike Pyle did it here in one round. The power being over in a hurry. So Mike Pyle... Thrills the crowd. 